Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. This is Enigma and you're watching Enigma Inc. So today we're going to do 18 to 31st of January. Let us see what are the messages for you Capricorns. So this is for Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus signs and Capricorns. Let us see. As usual, this is a general reading. Take however this resonates. For personal readings and more accuracy, you can book me on WhatsApp or Instagram me. All the details are in the description box. <clears throat> Follow me on Instagram for tarot related updates, offers manifestation guidance and much more subscribe to my channel and hit the bell icon and uh, also have my hindi channel in case you like watching hindi videos you can also subscribe to my channel there as well capricorns what are the messages okay all right oh scorpio pisces cancer some of you may have dealt with them this person left you okay Aries, Sagittarius, Leo. Hmm. I feel like Capricorn, you left someone and they are, you know, the moment you left this person, they're still, they started thinking and focusing on you. I feel like someone is deeply um, focused and attracted to you. Okay, the energy is all towards you. There's a lot of attraction. Also feel like um, being with you was much more fun than being without you so they've realized your worth they've immensely realized it because with so many options they choose you they feel like you brought them happiness and they could realize that there was something missing because of which you left and re they realize why you left okay they're trying to read you they're trying to observe you Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn they're feeling hurt because they know that they hurt you and they're not feeling good about it because you did not take any kind of a revenge or you, you simply walked away. So the moment you walked away, they realized that you were special. Okay. So yeah, I feel they're feeling very hurt because you're not focused on them right now. Capricorn. Also feel Capricorns, you have many options. Okay. You have many options. So you're like letting it go. You're not even bothered. You're like, okay, fine. If there's no love, not, not. Uh, enough love then I, sh I shall move on and let it go <sighs> this person is completely in their mind you know about you this they simply cannot take a step further or because of this lockdown some of you this person is trapped and cannot travel towards you okay they really want to travel because they're missing you they want to talk to you maybe you blocked them capricorns and they simply cannot hold themselves back Libra, Gemini, Aquarius for some. This person is too much into their mind. I feel like they've been thinking a lot in their mind now. They are feeling sad. They're feeling depressed. They're like, what to do now? Could be Scorpio, Pisces, Cancer. Capricorns. You were in a third party, I feel. This person was already dealing with someone else, okay? They had options. They were cheating on you. They were simply attracted to you and they were looking for something superficial a superficial kind of a connection nothing more serious but i feel like uh, you know they have options and they may not be serious about relationships and stuff not at least with you because right now they're simply like having uh, fun and you know being with people and being alone being single and being that center of attention so when you distracted yourself from this person they got furious, they got angry, they got jealous that why this person is not focusing on me, you know, you kind of burst the bubble they were having in their mind, like you're all into them, you cannot do without them and stuff like that. But when you decided to leave, cut the cords, that's when they realized that you were worth it, okay? That's when they felt, you know, a prick on their ego so that's how they their ego melted away so right now they want to make a move towards you with the three of cups i do see this was a friendship okay friendship uh, limited to attraction like friends with benefits kind of a thing nothing more than that so they're still into that energy but i don't see like right now they're into any in, uh, any intention to commit but they are not able to move on. Like they really want you in their life as a friend right now, for now. 
but I do see like they want to come towards you. Maybe they're taking help of your friend to reach out to you or they still want to be a friend of your. If they've been saying that you're simply a friend, you're simply a friend, even though there was attraction, they're coming back with the same energy. If you guys were in a relationship, they're coming back through a friend of yours. So they're simply stalking you. They're keeping a time to time, you know, um, watch on you. So yeah, they're watching you. Yes, they're very strong there. They're even asking your friends like where you're being, what you're doing, you know, they're very much into that. Oh my God. So I feel like now they're developing feelings. I do see like this started off as friendship. Okay. Like really strong attraction. Okay. And nothing more than friendship, just limited to friends. Okay. And then it started moving on to something very mutual, something very solid. And I feel like now they really want to give this connection a strong chance. You know, this time they're going to come towards you with a, with a strong chance, with something solid. So yeah. They're looking for you to reciprocate their feelings, okay? They want you to accept their offer. So they may come towards you with an offer this time. This is a friend who was attracted to you, who you were attracted to. I feel like you did a lot of efforts. You made a lot of efforts and they didn't realize it or they didn't give a fuck. And now when you moved on, that's when they realized, no, I, I just cannot let go of this person because they're so special and so valuable okay so they see you as someone who's extremely attractive okay you may be doing something that's um grabbing many people's eyeballs so you're grabbing eyeballs and i feel like you may be doing something that's related to artistry music beauty uh, you know salon and so anything like business or simply you're an artist so i feel like you are appearing to people in general like a very nurturing and a very caring women if you're a woman if this is a male watching then they see you as someone who is extremely attractive masculine strong confident so they're attracted to you the way you look your your how you're comfortable in your skin you know very virgo energy i feel like i just sensed a virgo very strongly either your person is virgo but i feel like Capricorn, you should check out your birth chart. You may be having sun, moon, rising or Venus in Virgo. Most of you. Because you're actually imbibing that energy. Even if you're not a Virgo, you're imbibing that energy very strongly. Like you're coming off as a very... You're coming off as a very um, independent, okay? Very classy person. Decent high standards person okay difficult to reach out but very good to talk to very sweet to talk to so yeah someone who likes nature being around nature who connects with nature very strongly so yeah that's how they see you mm. i feel like this is a strong libra gemini aquarius okay this person is very much into their mind about you you're thinking and thinking and thinking and doing nothing right now but they're determined to make a move they may be asking or getting inquiries about you through friends you know yes the third party is involved i i feel like they may be asking people about you if you're already committed if you're single if you moved on or if what what's happening in your life like how is it going because they're very attracted i feel like now they've started feeling very intense bond towards you and they want to take a u-turn okay come towards you and wish you you know um the best things in life like this time this person is wanting something solid okay and i feel like they may be watching you a lot there may be a work related connection for some of you but i feel that there's a strong they want an emotional you know beginning with you like turning into marriage or something like that they're already thinking about marriage oh my god this you as your as a true love they know that you are the one for them deception now why do i see this deception okay finances and career let me check one more, one more card please one more all right stay optimistic 
this person has hurt you in the past because there was a status difference or they didn't see you as worthy of them. As I told you, there's a work-related connection for some of you Capricorns and they didn't see you worthy enough of them and or they maybe they were playing you for fun, you know, for their own selfish reasons. So they left you. But I feel like the moment you started working on yourself, Capricorn, I very strongly sense the vibe that you started earning a lot, Capricorn, or you're making some good moolah, okay? You're making good moolah. So I feel like Capricorns, you're working on your finances and you're growing in your career. And this is why they're seeing you as going beyond their status right now. So they're feeling very excited about you. And they want to show you that, no, this is something. This person is not some someone to be taken very easy, okay? This person is something. So that's how they're going to come towards you. Romance. So they see a strong romantic life happening, love life happening with you. I just saw this video at 11.11. 11. So there's a romantic connection developing. Don't let pride get you. Know. I feel like this person has hurt you before. This could be a Leo person. But uh, this time you need to let your guard down. This time you need to let your pride down. Because maybe you were right in some, certain things. But this time they're really wanting to revive this connection with true heart. With genuine feeling. And they want you to give them a chance. And they don't want ego to come in, in between you, you guys. So you may pick up on certain things because of your ego being hurt in the past but i feel like no don't do that so as i told you this counseling this tarot reading is going to help you heal this connection for most of you because did you see this you heal with kind words wise advice and empathetic ear okay so someone is going to counsel you maybe most probably through this video that you need to use kind words with this person or with any kind of a relationship or any kind of um, a suitor that's wanting to you know talk to you so you need to use very sensibly your words your words should not be harsh your words should not be mean and you need to be open and you need to be kind you need to allow them to speak up because you may not listen to them you may build walls around you you may block them but i feel like this is going to hurt you in the end it's not going to work like that so you have to provide them ear you know a helping hand kind of a thing you know you have to listen to what they have to say to you because there's something very good that or romantic that they want to say to you all right so that's there for capricorns i hope you've enjoyed this reading if you did enjoy this do not forget to like this video hit the bell icon and mention the comment section how this resonated till i will see you next time bye